Hola mi gente, welcome back to the channel. My name is Sean and this is We Are Investing. On today's video, we are going to go over some institutional buys when it comes to SoFi that was just released in some 13F filings. You might be asking, what is a 13F filing? Well, this is an SEC filing for when institutions add to a stock or drop it or go short a company in a given quarter. When this information is released, these institutions are already invested in it. It's for the prior quarter. There is a lag from when we get the information. But around this time of the year, we're going to see more 13Fs come out and we'll have more information on what institutions are doing when it comes to stocks. Well, some good news. There are two and have added or started another position. One of these firms is extremely bullish. It comes in at number 18 out of 147 securities that they own. It comes in over Facebook. This is an institution that is investing more in SoFi than they are in Facebook. The other one, it comes in at around the middle, at around 50, at over, just over at number 54, I believe, out of around 120 securities. Now this is a position that they just opened up, they can add to, and most likely they will add to in the future over time. They're, they are going to dollar cost average, just like a retail investor does. Now, before we dive into the computer and I show you this information firsthand, please consider hitting that subscribe button, ringing that bell, and smashing that like button. It goes a long way in showing your support and it helps the channel grow. And if you wanna be even a bigger supporter of this channel, you can join the Patreon. It's $5 a month. It gives you access to a private Discord. It gives you access, it gives you access to valuation spreadsheets, to meetups. It's $5. A link is provided down below. And you can get two free stocks by signing up with Webull Two free stocks worth up to $2,300. A link is provided down below as well. But your time is valuable to me. Let's hop on over to the computer so I can show you this information. Let's do it. Okay, look at this. So in the last couple of days, we've gotten a lot of 13F filings for SoFi. This is when institutional money goes long or short a particular security. In this case, SoFi and a lot of these, most of these are going long, AKA they're bullish on the company. There are a ton of them. None of these institutions actually stand out to me. I don't know them firsthand because there are just so many of them out there. But what I do like to see is when institutions, if you take a look at this website, secform4.com, I do like to see when institutions actually make a certain stock a decent amount of the portfolio. Now you gotta consider what these are. These are institutions that own hundreds of stocks, sometimes thousands of securities. Now, there are two um, institutions here that have a relatively decent size weighting in SoFi. First American Trust at 0.4% and Vigilair Wealth Management at 1%. Now, if we take a look at these institutions, we can see what stocks they actually own. Now this is First American Trust, and if we include this to see where we're at with SoFi, we can see that SoFi comes in at number 57. And this is a new position that they just opened up. That means that this is their first purchase of SoFi. They can add to this and make this a bigger weighting. Most likely that is the strategy that these institutions implement. They don't just go all in on a stock in a one single order. They do it over time. They'll spread out their purchases over multiple quarters. But this first entry into SoFi is worth $3 million or 0.432% of the portfolio. It comes in at number 57. The total amount of stock securities that this institution owns is 124. So it's around that halfway point. Respectable for a company that right now is not profitable, trades on a price to sales multiple in an environment where these stocks have been getting hammered. But it might sign, but it might be a sign that some of these institutions are thinking that we're going to start to rebound and maybe we're at the bottom or very close to it. Now, that next institution that we're going to talk about is that Vigilaire Wealth Management Portfolio. And this portfolio, we're at around 1%. Let me expand this to 100 entries. Let's go to around 1% and there's SoFi. SoFi comes in at number 18 on the list. Now, look at the companies that it's around. We're looking at Pfizer. 
Procter & Gamble, Salesforce, Visa, Walmart, Johnson & Johnson, Meta Platforms, SoFi comes in higher than Facebook for this institution. Boeing, Shopify, a lot of respectable names, a lot of well-known companies that are not going to just fold. These companies can stay flat, they can move higher, but they are companies that are going to be around for the long term. So this position is even more bullish, coming in at number 18 on a total list of approximately 147. Coming in at number 18 out of 147 securities. They are extremely bullish on SoFi. That's a good sign. Maybe institutions are starting to think that we're getting towards a bottom in fintech and SoFi has room to run over the next 12 months. Let me know in the comment section down below if you think we're getting close to a bottom in SoFi. Let me know in the comment section down below what your price target is for this year when it comes to SoFi. I love to hear what you are all thinking. All right, that wraps it up. I thank you so much for your time. Until the next video, it's been real. It's been fun. It's been real fun. And this is We Are Investing and together we are invincible. See ya.